They both stand and move on to the final technique in the katami no kata, ashigarami. When the kata were first introduced, ashigarami qualified as a randori technique, but now it's prohibited. The tori hooks his left leg over the uke's right leg to lock it. The tori attempts a tomoe nage, but the uke steps forward with his right foot and tries to lift him. At that moment, however, the tori shifts his hips to the right and presses the back of his foot against the inside of the uke's left knee to pull him forward, hooking his leg over the uke's right. Here's how to hook the leg. The tori brings his left leg around the uke's right leg from behind and wedges his left foot against the uke's lower abdomen, twisting his hips to the right. He straightens his left leg and pulls with both hands to lock the knee. The uke attempts to escape by twisting to the left. The tori and uke move apart and assume kyoshi. From chikama, the tori takes two steps back to toma. The uke takes one step back to return to his starting position. They both stand and assume shizen hontai. They then return to their positions at the start of the kata. <laughs> 